Hi everybody, b 911 here once again for an RPG Maker XP tutorial. This time I'm going to be showing you guys uh, set weather effects. This one is really cool, I like using this one a lot. Um, now what you can do with this is set the different kinds of weather. They have rain, storm, and snow. Um, it has what power it's going to uh, affect it by, so if you have it on rain it's just going to be barely drizzling. If you have it on power 9 is going to be raining pretty hard. Um, and time is how long, I believe it's how long um, how long it takes to transition into it. So if I have a long time for it to transition to, um, the weather is going to slowly start getting uh, harder. So if I have it on rain, let's see, I'll select graphic for this so I can trigger it to show you guys. So, because it's going to happen over a hundred frames, it'll slowly start raining. And the effect is continuous until you turn it off or change it. So, I talk to this guy, and it slowly starts raining, and it starts getting harder, and now it's raining pretty hard. But if you want more rain than that, then you would switch it to storm. And I'll show you what storm looks like. So I talk to him, and it starts raining, and raining more, and raining harder. And with something like this, you would want to add uh, flashes of lightning. You would want to add the uh, thunder sound effects. And uh, you'd probably want to put in clouds and make it darker, and just make your maps look real. Real maps make games look good. They make people want to play them, and uh, yeah. So, they've also put in snow, and I'm glad they did this because they actually made snow maps, uh, snow tile sets that you can use. And I'll show you what the snow looks like. So, the snow doesn't get really hard. Um, it doesn't snow hard. But, um, let's see. I'll set the frame to zero and show you. Um, I'll take the graphic off, and I'll show you what it does. Put on parallel process um, for a normal map, and this how this is how it would normally be set up. So it's just snowing, and yeah. Um, I'll show you. I'll make a new map and snowfield. This is the map you can see on the tile set here. It has everything covered in frost. Um, the ground is white. Um, they have a little snowman here. The grass is full of frost, so it's white. Um, yeah, it just looks really nice. I'm glad that they put these in. And. I'll be right back. I'm going to create a little map for you guys and show you what this looks like. Hi everybody. I just finished the map, which I'll show you now. Um, this is what it looks like. I'll show you in the playtest. And here you go. A little snow field, and it's snowing. So yeah. You can... I didn't take a, a lot of time to do this, so I didn't put a lot of effort into it, but, and it's a, a very small map, but you can expand these and make them look phenomenal. So, put your effort into your games, guys. Really. It's worth it. So, if you have any questions or comments, um, leave a comment on this video. Uh, message me. Don't forget to subscribe. And rate me five stars leave comments for me and i hope you guys will join me in my next tutorial video and i'll see you then bye guys